Hi, my name is Lewis. How you doing? I want to talk to you a little bit today about uh, armpit odor. Armpit odor comes from, uh, well, first of all, there's a lot of bacteria that live in your armpits. There's probably 100 to 200 different strains, and there's billions of bacteria under each arm. Um, but the one that we're talking about today is Staphylococcus hominis. That particular bacteria has a very special set of enzymes that can convert um, a secretion. There's a molecule that uh, your apocrine glands secrete, and that bacteria can that has the enzymes to convert that secretion into thioalcohols. Okay, so. Anyway, when you sweat, there's two different glands that, that, uh, that are involved. There's perspiration glands, and the other one is an apocrine gland. And the apocrine gland is something that becomes active after puberty. Um, so, but there's a molecule in there that this, this uh, uh, bacteria has actually figured out how to turn it into something that they can use. So they turn it into a, a thiol alcohol, and it smells like rotten eggs. It's pretty pungent. So. Um, there is a use for thiol alcohols, and that is uh, as an odorant for natural gas, um, because natural gas doesn't really smell like anything. Uh, so to detect a leak in natural gas, it's very difficult. But if you odorize it with thiol alcohols, then it smells, you know, then it's got an odor to it, and you can detect it if it's leaking. So there is a use for it. Um, but anyway, to get rid of the odor, which is the subject of this video. Uh, an easy way to do it is to simply contaminate that molecule that the apocrine gland is putting out by using a little bit of sulfur. Uh, if, if you mix a little sulfur in with that secretion, um, the Staphylococcus hominis bacteria, as far as we can tell, doesn't want to eat it. So uh, it doesn't produce thiol alcohols and there's no armpit odor, so it works really well. So what I'm talking about is something like this product right here. It's, um, I don't know if you can see that. It's a, uh, it's a 4% sulfur ointment. And there's different manufacturers that make this. You can, you can find it online, you can find it in, in stores. Uh, it's, it's used for uh, acne treatments sometimes, but it's a, like a 4% sulfur ointment. And all it takes is a little finger dab of this stuff and you rub it into your armpits on each side and just coat yourself with it, but it's a very, very small amount. It just a, a little tiny finger dab just will do the whole trick. And what it does is it coats your, your armpit hairs if you have them, and it coats your armpit. And when your apocrine glands put out this molecule precursor that Staphylococcus hominis likes, Staphylococcus hominis will not, uh, will not consume that molecule. It won't consume the precursor, and it works really well. You actually won't have any armpit odor if you have a little bit of this sulfur, just a little tiny bit in your armpits. Uh, you can sweat like crazy. I mean, I've tested this stuff. I've gone to the gym and gotten completely aerobic and just drenched my shirt, and there is absolutely zero odor. There's no detectable odor at all. So it works great. A little bit of sulfur ointment gets rid of uh, armpit odor, and I, I use it rather than uh, a deodorant because I don't like the preservatives or also known as uh, xenoestrogens or parabens that are put into antiperspirants and deodorants typically. So we're talking about uh, methyl, butyl, ethyl, propyl. These are all parabens. They're considered xenoestrogens. They've been found in uh, breast cancer tissue. Uh, they've been tested in mice and men and, and have been connected with uh, sterility. You don't need anything that raises up estrogen in your body uh, because that, for men, it cuts down on testosterone production. And it, it becomes a carcinogenic, um, it, you know, the balance, anytime estrogen gets a lot higher than testosterone, uh, you, could, you could be prone to catching a cancer like a prostate cancer. So um, that's it. That's the cure. Uh, no xenoestrogens in this. Uh, you can get a little bit of a sulfur ointment, use that in your armpits, get rid of the armpit odor. Uh, of course, you might be starving the, uh, the Staphylococcus hominis bacteria, but, uh, but you'll be odor free. Thanks for watching.